I'm gonna show you the best way to get to the final world extremely quickly. So as you can see, a lot of players are on world three, and currently, it's extremely difficult to get to the last world. Now I'm in the last world as you can see, and I did a lot of strategies that pro players also use to get out of this world that you may not know about. So the first thing you need to do as soon as you get into world three is grind hand strength. Now if you're a free to play player, hand strength is the best stat to grind in this world. However, if you own the VIP game pass, the best way to grind will be knuckle strength. Now in order to grind knuckle strength, you'll need to be clicking very fast and you'll be earning a ton of knuckle strength per second. When first grinding in this world, your first goal should be to defeat the coconut. Now once you have enough strength to defeat the coconut, you should defeat him a few times as you'll earn a ton of wins so you can buy the first eggs in this world. Now these eggs have really good pets, and once you get some good pets, you'll be able to go back to grinding. So currently there's an event egg that has a ton of super OP pets, including this Hollow Dominus. Now the Hollow Dominus is super easy to get, as you can see I even own one. Now getting these eggs are also pretty easy, as all you have to do is defeat at least one beach boss. Now if you're strong enough to defeat the coconut, you can defeat him as many times as you want, and you can get a ton of event eggs. Now what I would suggest is to grind the event eggs, because these pets have insane stats, and they're extremely easy to get. Now the difficult part is getting enough strength to defeat the Kraken boss. So there's actually something you may have noticed that I did not talk about yet, and that is the enchant area. Now should you use the enchant machine? Well actually it's a bit complicated, so let me tell you what you should do. Now if you're in World 3, do not use the enchant machine. What you'll be needing the most in World 3 will be strength. And the reason why you shouldn't enchant your pets is because you'll be needing rebirths a lot. Now if you enchant your pets, you'll be losing a lot of rebirths. Now since rebirths help you get a ton of strength, you'll be losing a huge strength multiplier. So the next thing you should do is redeem all of the codes in the game currently. These codes give a huge boost toward grinding. And although there aren't a ton of codes in the game, some give huge multipliers toward your strength. The next thing you should be doing is grinding leagues. Now leagues are really important as if you advance to the next league, you'll get insane rewards and even earn a pet. Now why is this pet OP? This goes into my next point, which is trading. Trading is extremely important to getting OP and it'll even help you get OP pets like this one right here. Now how do you also get free pets? So using all of the strategies I told you to get to the final boss, you'll be able to get to the final world extremely quickly. Once you get OP pets, what I would recommend you to do is grind strength until you can successfully defeat the final boss. Now the next thing you should do is always grind with a friend boost. Friend boosts give you the biggest strength multiplier in the game, and there is a private server in the description and comments to grind. 